I'm at Show East at the Expand booth, and I'm looking at uh, all of their products that they're showing here uh, at the show. Uh, so th this group focuses on the, uh, the theatrical market, and the mainstay of that market is still the, the original uh, 101 glasses. These are uh, heavy-duty, uh, sealed uh, shutter glasses that can be uh, washed, so they're very uh, robust uh, and very popular. Of course, they're a little bit heavier than some of the uh, other models. Uh, so they now offer this, uh, I think it's the 102, 103 model um, that's a little bit lighter. It's not sealed, uh, but it's definitely a lot lighter uh, and, uh, uh, and has a little bit better uh, battery life, as I recall. Uh, there's also a, a children's version of this, uh, which is uh, uh, smaller, uh, in, smaller lenses and uh, shorter interocular uh, and tailored for the kids. Uh, again, it's the style of the, uh, of the 103, uh, so that, that, that works very well for them. Uh, the other part of the equation, of course, are the uh, emitters. Uh, these are infrared emitters that sit uh, in the projection booth uh, and emit uh, infrared radiation uh, for the synchronization of the glasses. That signal bounces off of the screen and comes back uh, to the glasses, uh, which are the emitter or the receiver is, uh, is right here in the middle, uh, and that helps synchronize it. Uh, this, this particular box here is, able, is for larger installations where you can uh, couple two, three, four, up to eight, in fact, limitless numbers of these, uh, these emitter uh, modules uh, to fill even up to 3,000 uh, seat theaters, which is what they showed at, uh, at CinemaCon uh, for the laser uh, demo uh, there. Um, now, they also offer a number of passive uh, solutions. Uh, this is a new uh, passive polarization switching unit. It's a big liquid crystal cell. Um, it's on a, uh, a track, but it's not motorized, so it can manually uh, move in and out of the projection path. Uh, and for those, of course, you want to use uh, passive polarized glasses, so they have a line of those uh, in adults uh, as well as in uh, a children's uh, size. Uh, the pricing for the polarization switch is, is about $2,500.